Alright, so uh, cikgu nak ajar macam mana cara nak jawab uh, paper paper 3 untuk section A soalan nombor 1. So, zoom tengok eh. Now, kalau kat sini kamu nampak variation is the difference between organism of the same species. Variation in plants can be affected by environmental factors such as pH value of the soil. Um, a group of students carry out an experiment to study the variation on the growth of lettuce finger plants which is affected by pH value of the soil. So, first kali yang kamu kena tahu ialah uh, cari dia punya aim of experiment. So, aim of experiment macam mana cara, nak cari dia? Kamu cari kat sini, dia ada guna perkataan experiment to study. So, ataupun ayat dia to investigate yang macam tu eh. So, to study the variation of the growth of lettuce finger plants which is affected by pH value of the soil. So, bila kamu nampak macam tu, kamu akan dapat dua variable which is manipulated variable dengan responding variable. So, bila kamu dah dapat manipulated dengan responding, mungkin kamu tak tahu mana satu. So, what you happen is that you will go to the next question. Okay. So, dekat sini kamu akan nampak the first question which is kamu kena recording kat dalam tu. So, bila kamu dah record, kamu uh, kamu kena tengok bacaan kat situ. So, kat sini kamu nampak bacaan dia 25, 26, 27. So, just write down 27 and you done. Okay. After that, dekat sini, oops, sorry. So, kita pakai kat sini 25, 26, 27 pun sama juga 27. Okay, just fill in every each uh, uh, recording. So, which is kat sini ialah 29, sini 28, sini 28, sini 27, sini 26, ni 25, ini uh, 24 dan ini 25. Once kamu dah record every each one of these, you dapat 3 markah. So, tolong baca betul-betul, record betul-betul and you will get 3 marks kat situ. Okay, now untuk video. soalan B1, uh, another question which is observation. So, untuk observation, ini teknik dia eh. So, first kali kamu tengok dekat uh, recording kamu tadi tu, kamu akan dapat the largest and the uh, smallest which is the lightest. So, dekat sini kalau kita nampak the largest will be uh, 29 and 28 and then the smallest will be 24 and 25 so senang ambil yang besar dan ambil yang kecil supaya kita boleh uh, compare benda tu kat dalam inference so just simply tengok kat sini for pot B soil pH 6.5 the mass of lady's finger 1 is 29 gram and 28 gram macam tu ok for pot E the soil pH 8, mass of the lady's finger 1 will be 24 gram and 25 gram. Dah, macam tu. So, kita pun recordkan dia eh. So, tengok betul-betul. For pot B, the mass... Oh, sorry. The soil pH of 6.5... The mass of lady's finger okay, um, for one is 29 gram and 28 gram. Macam tu. And then, repeat balik satu. For pot E, the soil pH of 80 the mass of lady's finger for one is 24 gram and 25 gram. Dah, siap. Tiga markah. <coughs> you do it. Alright. So, the next question will be inference. So, bila you dapat inference ni, is about your observation. So, that's the reason why cikgu minta kamu buat the highest and the lowest. Because the reason why, because you can answer the question for inference uh, a lot more easier. Okay. So, dia kata state the inference uh, for the observation 1 and observation 2. So, kalau kita nampak kat sini, the mass is uh, largest for 6.5 kan? Kalau kita tengok betul-betul pH dia, pH acidic. So, kita boleh lah declare benda tu. Kita kata, uh, the mass of lady's finger 
is largest in acidic soil. And then you bal you patah balik, you pergi kat sini. But for this one, as you can see, this one ialah it will be uh, a bit slight uh, slightest uh, alkaline. Kan? So you pun declare benda tu. So the mass of lady's finger is uh, smallest or lightest in alkali soil. And then you're done. Three marks. Okay. So, untuk the next question will be uh, variables. So, you nampak kat situ ada manipulated variable, ada responding dengan ada fixed variable or constant variable. So, you akan nampak method to handle the variable also lah dekat dalam ni. Alright, so untuk manipulated variable seperti yang kita nampak tadi, always find something yang you change. So, obviously, the one that you change is the soil pH. So, just simply say soil pH. Then. Next one, responding variable will be your mass, right? So, the mass of lady's finger. Okay, constant. So, fikir apa yang constant kat dalam ni? So, obviously kita pakai lady's finger kan? Type of lady's finger. Or you can say uh, the time taken or something like that. So, dekat constant variable memang ada banyak jawapan eh. So, cikgu pakai yang senang lah type of lady's finger. Alright, so method to handle kalau untuk manipulated, cikgu nak dengar perkataan different or change. So, you can simply say change the soil pH with... So, tadi kalau kita tengok betul-betul, start dia ialah... 6.0 kan? With 6.0 uh, Next one will be 6.5 7.0 7.5 And 8.0 Just pick up macam tu So you can simply use different Use different soil pH with 6.0 6.5, 7.0 7.5 and 8.0 Alright, then uh, Then with the manipulator Responding variable, the mass of lady's finger. And so you measure your mass uh, will, while using your uh, skill, right? So measure the mass of lady's finger by using scale and record the data. Okay. So next one uh, for constant variable, cikgu nak dengar perkataan uh, use the same ataupun fix so use the same type of lady's finger okay and there you go three marks you do it so next one for your hypothesis so hypothesis biasanya you guna perkataan the larger the smaller the bigger macam tu kan uh, you can simply use that for your uh, hypothesis but uh, for this one cikgu nak pakai compare to ataupun then so hypothesis untuk case ni kita nampak yang bahawa pH yang sesuai ialah slightly acidic right compared to uh, alkaline so um, the slightly acidic soil uh, will produce more larger uh, ladies a uh, mass of ladies finger compared to alkaline soil and you done mm, yep. All right, so next one will be construct a table and record all the data. So kat sini you nampak Ida bagi tahu siap-siap apa yang dia nak. So you just simply buat table biasa. Tak payah buat pelbagai baris. You will be fine. Okay. So kat sini kebetulan dia ada dua kan? A ladies finger 1 and 2. So this one will be your um, average. So just simply buat oh sorry for my slightly like that. Okay. Oh, kat sini pun ada. Okay, so you dah buat macam ni and then next one will be pH soil and then this one will be a uh, mass of lady's finger. For this one, one, two. For this one will be average mass. 
Jangan lupa mesti ada unit So uh, write down the unit This will be gram And this will be your gram So pH tak ada uh, unit So you just simply do like that So your pH will be 6.0 6.5 7.0 7.5 8.0 .0. Your uh, pH 1 will be 27, uh, 29, 28, 26, 24 The one yang you record tadi yang dekat dalam you punya measurement eh Lepas tu yang dekat sini 27, 28, 27, 25 and 25 So untuk average you just simply tambah and then you bahagi dua kan So you dapat 27 here, 28.5 and then 27.5 and then 25.5 and for this one oops 25.5 and then 24.5 and bila you dah buat macam ni check balik unit you jangan betul you punya kiraan betul semua everything smoking and then you dapat 3 marks and then you do it okay